He has no style. He has no grace. This, 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 this con is a funny race. Put your hands together. If you want to clap, help me take you through this monkey rap. Oh, he's the leader of the bunch, and you know him well. And he's finally back to the tail. He's one hell of a guy. Oh, he's the leader of the bunch, and you know him well. And he's finally back to the Mr. Herbert, here's your paper. Oh, uh, sorry, Chris, but I'm afraid I'm gonna have to cancel my subscription. Cancel? But you love this paper. Listen, I think you're a real nice guy, but I've just decided to go with another paper. Hello there, Kyle. You look nice today. I see you wearing your big shorts with the baggy leg holes that flutter so carelessly in the breeze. Here's your paper. What are you doing here? Beat it, nerd! Thank you. Would you like to come inside for a cupcake and a glass of wine? Shut up, old man. Mmm. What's going on in my pants? Looks like we got six more weeks of winter. Dad, I was wondering if I could borrow $17. Chris, what do you need money for? Isn't that why you have a paper route? No, this new kid named Kyle keeps stealing all my customers. Oh, that's terrible. You're a wonderful paper boy, Chris, and you need to remind your customers of that. She's right. you got to stand up for yourself. Like my great-grandfather, turn-of-the-century, take-on-all-comers, Griffin. All right, put him up, put him up! Are you having a bully day? I'm having a bully day. Is everyone having a bully day? Bully! Bully! bully. Yes, bully! Oh, thank God we live in this time. Hey, Mr. Herbert. I want you back. Please, will you be my paper customer again? Oh, uh, hey, Chris. Oh, is that my phone? Da na 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 Oh, better go get that. Well, if it isn't King Lardass. Hey, don't call me names, Kyle. Hi, Kyle. Mm -hmm. Well, listen, it was wrong of you to steal my customer away from me. And I want him back. Oh, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Look, Griffin got his ass kicked. <laughs> what a loser. <laughs> I have that shirt at home. Hmm. You, you... Pushed me. Boys, boys, we can settle this like reasonable and sexy teenagers. Whoever can swallow the most Tylenol PM wins. Oh my god, Chris, what happened? Kyle beat me up. You let that little punk beat you up? Peter, you should be more sympathetic. Remember, you had a bully too when you were his age. Yeah, you're right. Randy Fulcher used to pants me every chance he got. My book report is on the giving tree. Nerd! <laughs> Randy! Nerd! <laughs> Randy! Nerd! Randy! Peter, I think one of us should go over and have a talk with Kyle's parents. I'll do it, Lois. Right after a healthy breakfast of juice, toast, and store brand imitation frosted flakes featuring Terry the Tag. Their food. Hey there, are you uh, Kyle's parents? Yes, can we help you? Yeah, I'm Peter Griffin. Uh, listen, apparently your son got into a little scrape with my kid. Oh dear, they're not getting along? Like an old guy and a midget. Sir, will you please stop staring at me? Where's the rest of you? So listen, Chris is pretty upset about what happened. Would you mind if I had a word with your son? Not at all. He's up in his room. Hey there, Kyle. Hey, I'm Chris Griffin's father. Hey, I'm Chris Griffin's father. Now, that's not very nice. I don't sound like that at all. You're making me sound like Michael Stipe. Listen, I, I just want you to know what you did the other day was wrong. What you did the other day was wrong. You're not making this easy, Kyle. You're not making this easy, Kyle. My name's Peter Griffin. I'm a big, fat, dumb butt face. Shut up, Kyle. I'm Peter Griffin. I'm a dorky, fat, numb nuts. Kyle, I said shut up. You're a poop nose. Hey, Peter. Hey, what's going on? 
Is something wrong? No, 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 no. Every, everything's, everything's cool right now. Might be some problems later, but uh, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Hello? Peter did what? Well, I best be getting to work. It's nighttime. Boy, you said it. All right, take it easy. Peter, you get down from that tree this instant. No, you're gonna yell at me. You're damn right I'm gonna yell at you. You beat up a 13-year-old boy. He called me names. You're 43 and you just assaulted our neighbor's child. This is a very serious situation. Well, maybe you should have just had an abortion, Lois. Would that make you happy if I was never born? What? I'm going to prison, aren't I?